I was the first. I don't have a name other than Blue. My twin Red deserted many years ago, and he's not been seen since. But I was the first, and I never thought that the time we spent playing together would lead in the direction it has. We started in Dernavaria, Dorchester to you, and have ended up, half a century later, in Ad Divises, or Devises as you may know it, similar towns in so many ways. I may not be played with any more, but I was the first, and have a place of honour. He still plays though, just not with me. It's funny how things work out. It would have been in the early 1970s when he first came to Devises. He came to play in a competition, and a few years later he was a regular attendee at Attack, the annual war game show. Grown men playing with toy soldiers? Well, let me tell you, the show has been going for over 30 years. Each July, people come from all over the country, and Europe too. They play in competitions, spend money with traders, and enjoy a pint of 6x in the local pubs. They stay at local hotels and guest houses, and the town is usually fully booked for the attack weekend. Visitors and competitors may give little thought to devices and district war games group setting up the show. The show takes months of planning, venue, traders, competitors and demonstration games have to be booked and coordinated. Tables need repainting or replacing, then they have to be screwed together ready for play. Carpeting has to be stored, transported and laid to protect the gym floors at Devizes School. Wives and partners have to be persuaded to run the canteen and buy the food and drink ready for consumption. And prizes have to be bought and engraved ready for the victors. The whole thing is run like a military exercise. Just as well really with between 500 and 900 visitors over a single weekend. Talking things over with old comrades is much of the pleasure, and return visits to other shows make it doubly so. Birmingham, London, Nottingham, Mansfield, Exeter are to name just a few places the Devizes group invades on a regular basis. Look at him, all tanned and fresh back from the holiday, the day before the NEC show, not that he took me to either place. And they do their bit for the local community too, by donating money raised through a raffle at the show. The Brownies, Children of Victims of Domestic Violence, the Salvation Army and the Royal British Legion have all benefited in recent years. So apart from making lifelong friends, learning about history, tactics, geography and artistic skills, what has he got from it all? Well, me. And I started it all. Wonder what happened to Red? Ha 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 ha!